We're looking at the Kumbu Glacier at the base of Noopsi, and also you can see the Kumbu Icefall off in the distance. When we first came to Everest Base Camp several weeks ago, this portion of the glacier was completely covered in snow and ice. It was pure white. As the weeks have gone on, there's been a little bit of spring melting, and now you can see that there's a lot of rocky material between the icy spires. Lots of boulder fields. Uh, those boulder fields are composed of dark colored rock that absorbs solar energy, solar radiation, heats up, and causes even more melting. We call that a positive feedback influence, where the dark rocks actually enhance melting once they're exposed. Another feature that you can see are these icy spires or columns between the boulder fields. And I would challenge the students to look up the name of those icy spires. There's a specific name that they're called. Find out what that is and do a little more research on this business of positive feedback melting on glaciers.